Well, these relentless storms and flash flooding have left roads in rough shape here. 22 News reporter Melissa Torres shows us how it's impacting communities in Franklin County. That's right, this recent string of detrimental storms have left roads in really rough shape. We're right now in Franklin County, as you can see behind me. These storms have left roads in very bad condition. We're currently on Graves Road in Deerfield, and as you can see, Behind me, the road is currently closed through traffic for the time being. Deerfield is one of the many towns in Franklin County that have been working hard to reopen many of the roads and fix a lot of the infrastructure problems they are currently faced with. This past Friday, some cities and towns received nearly four inches of rain. That rain closed several roadways due to flash flooding, mudslides, landslides, and other weather-related damages. I was out this weekend with my friend on our motorcycles and we just kept coming up to road closed and damage and then we were out mountain biking on Sunday and the trail was completely washed out. It's just been brutal for you know people who live especially like on dirt roads and the farmers are just really having a hard time. I was actually out by Lower Road where uh, 15 feet of the road was actually taken out. It's a hole. The only thing that's left is the uh, sewage pipe just hanging there. There's been over in Old Deerfield where the, they've had landslides. They are handling it as fast as they can. Local law enforcement and cleanup crews are still working to redirect a lot of the traffic in this town and surrounding towns, but many areas are still covered in cones. Right now, state leaders are meeting with local communities to assess the current damage left behind from those storms. They're hoping to secure funding soon to go towards recovery efforts in towns like this one in Franklin County. Working for you, Elisa Torres, 22 News.